Yeah, Scott, the Cartwright family just got finished up holding a fundraiser here on the first anniversary since the shooting. They say they're hoping to turn tragedy into a rallying cry. They say on this day last year, last year around five in the morning, the business owner was standing right in the front here when he looked up to a gun pointed in his face. The shooter fired six shots. None actually hit him, just a graze mark. But one of the bullets did hit John Cartwright's cell phone. Bullets did some damage to his storefront, too, breaking some of the windows. The Carbright family says the crime scene itself, though, seemed to leave a permanent stain on this area of McWillie Drive. Here we are a year later, trying to uh, do what the sign says, is we're claiming this in the place of God's name and that we are fully taking control of the place and going to renovate it, and we're in the process of that right now. Families sold t-shirts and art to try to get enough money to complete the renovations. All those repairs to the interior and exterior of the business should be complete within the next few months. Coming up at 10, how the Cartwright family believes the shooting and the renovations following it could help improve more businesses in this area than just their own. Live in Jackson, Jennifer Lott, 16 WAPT News.